Yeah, let's keep it in order. Okay, let's get the team lined up. Jason Thomas, I'm the creator of the character Solid, and I also helped uh, write a little bit and illustrate it. My name's Chris Jones, and I do pages one through three. Justin Anderson did pages four and eleven. And I'm Ramon Jones, and he's getting a pencil. He told me I had to draw something. <laughs> <laughs> That'll work. <laughs> All right, so let um. Tell, tell the story, please. Okay, uh, the story kind of begins at uh, the uh, football game. Uh, he's in high school, and it's, he's with his uh, mom and dad, and they kind of have a conversation. Uh, I'm just going to come. That's me. And uh, having a conversation about the son, and then uh, it goes into a, a flashback, kind of a backstory as to uh, how his father uh, got injured when he was playing uh, pro football. And he had these uh, scientists coming to him about using performance uh, enhancers. Uh, so this kind of gives a little backstory of, of that. Chris did a wonderful job on one of these pages. So that's mostly that. And then it <laughs> continues. It goes back to where they're uh, at the uh, at the game. And um, yeah, and then he has, he's kind of says something to him that he doesn't really care for, so Solid, he kind of leaves and goes off on his own. And then he switches to the uh, bank robbery uh, scene where he was, uh, they were robbing, a, well, a gang was, was doing a robbery, and it was foiled uh, inadvertently by uh, Solid. And uh, this is, we're kind of setting this part up for uh, for some stuff later on in the series. So this is uh, the gang members who were uh, foiled, and they, uh, give the name. Yeah, they were uh, searching for, or they were trying to steal something that uh, you don't know what it is just yet. All right. And when he was, uh, he actually uh, had a, uh, a news uh, broadcast came out about the uh, robbery and how he pulled it. And uh, this is a bar scene in uh, rural Georgia where we introduce uh, the uh, hangman, uh, Griffin the hangman, while they're in the bar uh, that is coming on the news. The news exclusive where, where they, they, they say we have a, a young hero that foiled a robbery. And while that's going on, there's a fight going on. Uh, basically, Griffin Heyman kicking everybody's butt because he's way bigger than everybody. And uh, it was it's a bar that, uh, like a, a bar that blacks and whites go to frequently. He didn't like it because his whole thing is basically racism. So he comes in there and tears up the bar. And then he sees uh, the TV with the interview going with Solid and his parents. And... Uh, He's just basically cleaning the house, and he sees it. He sees the TV, and he's like, solid, huh? And he's like, we're going to see about that. And then it goes into the, uh, the uh, they're honoring uh, solid at the, uh, the city is honoring him for, for his heroics. And uh, he gets there, and uh, Griffin actually finds where it's, where, it's, where it's going down. He shows up. He jumps off the top of a building and lands. Makes a big doom sound like in the old Marvel days. And he confronts Solid, and 
kind of skips a page, but uh, he confronts them, and this is the final page where he confronts them, and they're going to get into it. It's time for the bird. Good job, y'all. So, uh, whose characters are these? Who's them all with characters? My, my characters. Your characters? When did you first think of them? Uh, in 2002. 2002. Thinking of stories to go along with it? Or? Yeah, I have about five stories, five comics. How'd you get inspired for the character? Uh, I was reading a lot of Incredible Hulk. Uh, basically, was a, was a big inspiration. Um, Brother Man at the time, I, I had I went back and started reading my old Brother Man comics because I met Dawu right around that time in person for the first time. And I just went back and started reading them. I was like, you know, I kind of feel what he was doing with, with these uh, characters that look like me. And so I kind of um, just ran with it. I think I had this big Incredible Hulk toy in my room, and I looked at it, and I was like, this is kind of cool, big giant. And I just kind of used that as a model. Like, first few uh, drawings I did was an Incredible Hulk toy. And I uh, just kind of went from there. Yeah. All right. And um, the, the story, uh, whose idea was it to tell this story, or this part, the beginning of the character? <laughs> uh, well, it was Jason's idea. I just helped him... Uh, Structure it out more and script out the actual uh, the actual story. How did the other artists decide to pick the page they're gonna work on? Random. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty random. He get a page done and get, we go, who wants to do it? Yeah, with the yeah. tight turnaround, it got to the point where I was just writing a page and then just handing it to people. So it was, it was actually really fun. Did the artists have fun? Yeah. yeah. No. It's great. Are you gonna continue being artists? Oh, yes, sir. Yeah. That's right. All right. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> Yeah, no, but I don't want to hold it. All right, it's good, it's good. All right, cool. We are good. What is that? Oh, I can't have a thumbs up. I'm just doing all the hell, the hell, the hell. All right. Got it. You got it?